Hang on with the mausoleum tour. These walls were built during the Zandia, Zandia era. These are some small parts that were built during the Sunday period and age from then till now. Over here in the mausoleum, they've got a handcraft exhibition and workshop. Moving oh. forward into this side here. And there's the entrance. So, To the Hello. Of the handcraft workshop. I put the people who handcrafted things and they were selling them. All sorts of stuff. I handcrafted pots, vases, pen holders. They put paper in, they put paper and use a pen to write something down. We've got a backgammon table which you can open up. One side is a chessboard and the other side is a backgammon table. Mm -hmm. board, we've got some more, we've got some rugs, one for sale, some necklaces, bracelets, bags, locks, all sorts of other stuff. Got some more food, all sorts of handcrafted pots and pans, bags. Plates, bowls, tea sets, I don't know. Stuffy. But well, in that you can put whiskey in there. You use this to drink the whiskey and you know, put some other stuff. You even got some of them boxes where you can store jewelry, like some small jewelry boxes. You can use the jewelry or you can store other things in. So the handcrafted things over here. Got some copper stuff. Now, coming back out of the handcraft shops. Further forward. Coming outside the handcraft shop and to another side of the mausoleum. So is it now? Now is how it was before. Before, now. Before, now. This is how it looked like before. This is how it is now. It's been refurbished many times. I'm gonna rough down. Come on, Alright, as we move back to where I was before, I'm now going to enter another part of the mausoleum to see the, what more is there. They made this place pretty nice, pretty nicely. Now moving into this side of the mausoleum. We have a few gravestones where they have been buried over this very ground.
A little flat. So that's this part of the sign. Now let's see what which other those leads to where around this museum. Let's see what other parts they have for us to see. Now let's move down. To the west side of the Lord's alien. Which looks to be where we might have. So I'm going to Of the most area. Here we go. Many, many other um, poets have been buried in this mausoleum, like this one, Muhammad Ali Avami, that's one of them, and various other famous poets have been buried. And this is half of his tombstone, which looks like to. They've engraved one of his poems down on his tombstone. These are in various others. Now we have got four of the. And this is Saturday's tombstone. So the mausoleum of Saturday and Hofizer was the same place. And this is Molavi's tombstone. And there's the two other. Another poet, Hulaku, and. And a famous writer. And Abadi is the, the, that last tombstone. Who's the world being buried with. buried in the mausoleum of Hafez. Now moving around the mausoleum. We are led to a massive garden. And of course, all the way around the mausoleum. Huh? This is Sadi's voice. Wait. The song that is, the song that Sadi is singing, has been written by the writer named Abadi, which we saw his tombstone just a few minutes ago. Moving around, there's some other parts of the mausoleum. Let's go this way. Let's see what's on this side of the mausoleum. 
abs will move up. So, there, that's another part of the garden. And here we have a pineapple tree over here. And we have various other people who have been who have been sitting around and been buried here many, many years ago. And they say that this tree here was planted by Saadi. And there are some other people who have been buried in the mausoleum of Hafez all over here. Various, various famous people of Iran. Some kings, some writers, some other poets and some very other famous people that have been buried in the mausoleum of Hafez. I'm now moving through. And looks like that's the end of this. Logan says to you out.